Now let's turn to Gombe State, uh, where a campaign has been launched to immunize one million livestock against infectious uh, diseases. Governor Inua Heaya, while launching the campaign, highlighted its importance in relation to the coronavirus ravaging some countries. TVC News correspondent Larry Adievi was there. <laughs> The emblem of Gombe State as a cattle prominent at the center. This clearly shows the predominant occupation of the people. Animal husbandry. 75 to 80 percent of our people are peasant farmers who depend solely on livestock and food production, crop production. And they need support, they need guidance. We are farmers and we are breeders at the same time. We are trying to think an opportunity whereby these Fulanis, instead of them going outside to other states, as a result of, you know, having some clashes, they, we are going to start resettling them. Either it is Ruga or the Livestock Transformation Plan or ranching, issues surrounding animal husbandry have remained a matter of public interest for several months. For Gombe, Livestock rearing is beyond just another talking point. It is a matter of survival for our people. The campaign to vaccinate one million farm animals is aimed at boosting businesses, but also to protect farmers and consumers. An annual vaccination which has not been done for the past five, six years, but now it's been done here. We have budgeted, if we intended to vaccinate more than one million cattle and sheep. The government has bought enough vaccines from the National Veterinary Research Institute so that we make sure that it is the correct vaccine that is being utilized to do this service. There's the coronavirus ravaging around the world. Then there's SARS and Lassa fever. All these animal born diseases transmitted to humans. It this shows the importance of vaccination of these livestock against diseases that could be transmitted to humans. Landry Adeyemi, CVC News, Kombi.